Hi everybody, it's the Soap Man and it's Saturday evening and time to make some soap. So what I'm going to be doing this evening is another in the pot swirl. I'll be doing a white base with titanium dioxide and for the three accent colors, it might be a little strange, I'm not sure, but we're going to find out. I'll be using activated charcoal for the black. I'm using Bramble Berries Caribbean Blue for a nice blue mica and to really set things off. Nurture Soap's Neon Green Pigment. I'm going to be scenting it with Bramble Berries, Pomegranate, and Black Currant. This is a favorite of mine. I've used it for years because it holds up well. I mean, it holds up really well in cold process. It has a nice, bright, uh, fruity scent to it. So, let's just get right into it and put our lye into our oils. Make a little bit of noise and make some soap. emulsification. And that is good to start. I'm going to stick blend a little bit more with the colors, especially the titanium dioxide. So, into, oh my goodness, I turned the calculator off just a second. So, into my three accent colors, I want about 14.6 ounces. Once again, as always, close is absolutely good enough. Shoot, that's too much. I wasn't paying attention. Okay. Of course, now I'm making a mess all over the place. But it wouldn't be making soap if I didn't make a huge mess, let's face it. And that's why we have towels. Okay. So into our base. We'll put our Tidox. I'm just going to hand stir it at first. I am going to stick blend. Into our three accent colors. Okay, here's going to our colors. watch, you know I normally disperse my colors in oil. I'm being a little daring today. I'm just putting the dry powder right in. Ah. 
because it's holding up well and it's a little runny. I like my in the pot swirl to be just a little bit thick because the lines and the shapes and everything just seem to hold a little bit better when it's got a little bit of thickness too. So let's stir our white. holding up really well so let's hit it very lightly with the stick blender and I'll put the fragrance in and I'll pour it into the white. That's how I have, the, have everything measured. And then for the rest, a third, a third, and a third. And I'm going to hand stir these in, and then I'm going to pour. Worry not, I'll clean those up off camera. 
that will not be going to waste. And we'll take our spatula and give it just sort of a little bit of swirl. It's getting a little thick on me. Let that sit for about five minutes and spritz it with some alcohol to prevent soda ash. And put it to bed in a nice warm spot. So, so far I like it and wow, it smells good. Love that fragrance oil. So I'll hopefully see you tomorrow for the cutting. All right, everybody. Thanks for watching. Bye.